Hey everybody, George Donnelly here uh, with a vlog about how fast can we grow uh, Bitcoin Cash adoption. So I know there's a lot of kind of negativity and in fact, I uh, recently did a flip starter in which I said my goal was going to be to add 1 million uh, new, uh, to onboard 1 million uh, new Bitcoin Cash users uh, by the end of uh, 2021. And I got some feedback on that. You know, for example, uh, someone said, oh, you know, if you could really do that, you know, Google and Facebook would be knocking down your door begging you to work for them. Um, and, uh, you know, be that as it may, uh, whether the goal is ultimately achieved or not, whether, you know, somebody thinks it's feasible, somebody thinks it's not. Uh, the bottom line is that, frankly, at the end of the day, only big projects with big visions and big goals are worth our trouble. You know, if we set small goals with a small vision, we're never going to get anywhere. You have to aim at the stars, you know, if you want to reach the moon. Or maybe that saying goes the other way. In any case, you have to aim much higher than you, than, you, know, you think is feasible if you want to get to... Uh, to a place that represents significant growth, if you want to test your limits, if you want to really, um, you know, increase your ability. You know, it's like you don't go to the gym and, you know, bench press five pounds, you don't, you know, unless you've had some kind of serious injury or, or you're a baby, you know. You go there and you put on weight that is a challenge for you. And it's the same thing with this. So, you know, let's take a look at this. So, you know, let's say that uh, we're able to onboard 2,000 new uh, users by the end of October 2020, which is pretty, um, that's a pretty modest goal. Um, you know, and let's say, so let's go over here to the 100% growth rate. So basically this means that, um, you know, for each of these 2,000 people that gets onboarded, is going to onboard another person and so on and so on and so on. You know, I onboard somebody, they onboard somebody, then they onboard somebody. And then, so we get to a position there, are, I think around five, four to 5 billion, I don't know, three and a half to 5 billion adults in the world, basically within an age range that, you know, it makes sense to, to address, you know, maybe between like, uh, 12, you know, I know 12 years are not adults, but, you know, let's say between 12 and uh, 50 or 60, you know. So, um, you know, if, if, if we were able to sustain that growth rate, I think that we would achieve, we would basically achieve um, global adoption, you know, somewhere uh, near the end of, uh, somewhere in the third quarter of 2022, you know, and let's look at a 200% growth rate. So, each of us, each person who gets on board, so we each on board, and then that, sorry, we each on board two, and then in succession, each of those people on board two, et cetera. And in that case, you know, we would basically have the world, the whole world covered by the end of 2021. Now, these aren't really realistic plans, um, but they're an illustration, right? Because if we go here, so let's say I want to achieve 1 million by uh, December 2021. Well, then I need a growth rate of 55.88%, uh, which is basically uh, every, new, every two new people uh, add one new one, I think. I don't know. You know, I did all right up and up through like trigonometry and math and all that, uh, algebra and all that stuff. But anyway, yeah, 56% growth rate is a big deal. Um, but is it impossible? No, of course not, especially since we're starting from such uh, a low place. You know, you take any startup and uh, with well defined promotional scheme, marketing, it can have growth rates in the thousands, in the thousand percent range early on, you know, of course that, you know, that curve will jump up fast and of course it'll, it'll slow down, it'll flatten out over time. You can't sustain uh, the hockey puck uh, over time. Whereas let's say those of us who are more cynical, 
pessimistic and let's say we take a 1% growth rate and you know we're gonna have to scroll down for a while this is gonna take a while um yeah this is gonna take a while damn holy cow when are we gonna get here so yeah so somewhere around like 2086 or so <laughs> of course you know, the, the population will have, you know, like some people will have passed on and new people who will have born, been born. We have gone through, a f what, like t two generations by then? <laughs> I mean, it's like we'll have to start all over again. So, you know, wh what's the bottom line? Yeah, I do think that, you know, achieving um, one million people, uh, one million new um, users uh within about 15 months is absolutely feasible we it is possible i think it will take a team effort uh across the ecosystem and i think we all need to think about you know not necessarily that hey you have to go out you know with bitcoin cash stickers to a protest and onboard 10 people no but we need to think about systems and we need to think about value and um I think we need to work together to make it happen. So I just wanted to share this thought. Um, uh, you know, let's let's keep building Bitcoin Cash.